Good afternoon. My name is Rajesh Yadav. I've done my master's uh, in biotechnology from IIT Bombay uh, and from like bachelor's in biotechnology itself from Mumbai University. So basically, I'm born in Tamil Nadu and brought up in Mumbai. So after my master's, I was looking for uh, new job opportunities and uh, I was a part of placement team of IIT Bombay. I went through different corporate sectors. I understood the market of biotechnology and healthcare. So, uh, but I chose to get into teaching because I thought, okay, let me explore this field later, not directly jump into healthcare. So I was teaching for last 14 months in Bangalore. Then I, I just came across this uh, advertisement or application process for Center for Healthcare Entrepreneurship in IIT Hyderabad. So uh, I was very amazed to see such kind of uh, healthcare centers in uh, Indian market and uh, I just applied to it. It was the, the application process was very complicated. So there were on 100, I mean 1,300 applications out of which they selected few of them, the, the few hundreds of them, they took it for Skype interview. And then 30 of the top 30 were selected for the final interview here, where we had a two day interview process and finally 10 of us are selected here. So we are from different background, uh, from like MBA in sales and marketing and from 10 years experience to a postdoc from Harvard. So it's just, and people from design, mechanical engineering, electrical, comm science, PhD in optics, MBBS doctors, BDS, you see everything which is required to start a company, we have everything. So this, this program itself is so diverse. They have selected people from diverse like uh, qualification and experience to, Im to have input from all different fields. So this helped us to uh, know the lacks which we have. For example, I'm from biotech. I know what, how like people from electrical will think a problem for. So this helped us for a clinical immersion. So our program is for a one year program in which we go to hospitals in and around Hyderabad as a first phase where we, we at least spend around in five different hospitals. We went to each and every department of the first two hospitals and uh, we explored the all departments we saw the problems we talked to the like uh, doctors the patients over there the nurse the stakeholders the attenders everything and then we saw the problem from the grassroots level we understood the problem in detail and then we we just jotted it down okay what the problem is from the problem we made the problem statement from the problem statement we made the need what is the exact need so need and something which is special to add on is something different so our progress and our approach is only to find the need not to add something on so that it will be increasing in technology so we wanted to know only the need so uh, we have around like 200 and 300 plus needs right now in particular domain so once we go from a part like once we had like different different domain we saw different different department we saw out of which we have to focus it to one particular domain so if you want to talk about like uh, I'm, I'm working on diagnostic domain you'll be working on vital parameters so like different different domains even in EMD itself emergency medicine so there are people who are working on uh, gastrointestinal gastro, uh, GI GI based problems like cancers in GI so this helps us to understand the problem in, in basic level so first we had pro observation from observation we took the problem and then need so this took around uh, four months for us like from august 1st we started and right by end of november we ended our clinical immersion and now we are working on the need statement understanding the market what exactly is the market size and how big is the market which you want to enter in future and uh, also to know the problems which are there and how frequent the problems are the incident state everything and then we had two ideation process so this ideation process will take next two to three months where we'll be looking and we also have to validate our data so we just saw the value like the data only in hyderabad setup we'll be looking in different cities like bangalore mumbai delhi like different hospitals like mumbai tmh uh, in case of Tamil Nadu, Jipmer and Delhi, Ames, we're looking for different different hospitals and validating our data whether this top 15 needs are there in those setups or we are looking a problem in a, only in a particular setup. So this reduces the uh, error which we might have, which you have like for example a device which might which we made which we which is solving a problem for X, which might which might which might not be a problem in case of Delhi. It's only specific location only in Hyderabad. That errors are being reduced and also to know the incident state in different sta different states and uh, all over the country to get and to uh, so this was the first ideation process and then we look for solution how to make the solution so for a single need we'll have four to five solutions so even that we have to find out and the top best solutions which we think which is required for the market we just work on it and then we present at the end of around july where we present the ideas and then finally uh, there are members who like 
like have a validation and then say okay fine you are the one who will be selected for the incubation process and then next two years will be incubated in iit hyderabad cfhc centers uh, and we also get some seed grants from iit from cfhc center itself and then we apply for different uh, uh, like funding agencies so one of them is byrac and our previous uh, like members have applied through gates and melinda byrac big byrac uh, grants and uh, there are many other grants which we are applying for so this is our basic idea about getting into the market uh, to finish off my like uh, talk i just want to say why i entered into the market so uh, this healthcare is a domain which i think it's something i'm attached to because i'm from biotech background i know what the problem is so i thought if i enter into the market it will be much easier and i think it's the right time for me to enter because this is a startup area in case of india it's growing at a good high space so if we can find a space in this healthcare sector it's the right time for me yes hello i am amit vanneko from hubli karnataka i did my uh, graduation in biotechnology soon after my graduation i started with my startup called biosyn we were mainly focusing on uh, building a food testing kits so we saw like a lot of adulteration has been happening everywhere due to uh, demand in the market and all so the first flagship product that was launched was milk adulteration test kit where like lot of milk is getting adulterated all over india so that product is doing pretty good into the market and all there like when i started we didn't know all the things to be followed like what are the kinds of markets that we need to do then what are the initial demands how to portfolio the product what are the needs how to get into the market without so like initially it took me around 2 years of r&d in order to complete and almost another 6 months to launch into the market that was the timeline where i faced lot of problems then like now it's been almost one and a half year that product is launched and it is doing pretty good into the market i have an a uh, small idea like why can't uh, whatever the milk test kit we developed it's like a soft a lab in a pocket where you can uh, take it anywhere and test it why can't we design a similar diagnostic test kit i was not from any medical background like i didn't had any much core idea so i got uh details about the cfc there is a program like which can help in the healthcare needs like where like versatile background fellows comes into contact builds up a product so we saw like last two cohorts like had done very good thing were building up products and all so that's how i came into this uh, facility wise like we've been here from last 5 months so we've been thought with lot of facilities like initially we went through learn like all the designing tool like solid works and all like where we learned actually the how we can design the products then after like we have here good laboratory facilities across the college where if you want to build up any from the wet lab to the any engineering aspects like tooling or else like they have a very good facilities then the collaboration with the hospitals they have uh, mov with few uh, tertiary care hospitals like uh, kamineni then aig which are very pretty good hospitals at hyderabad like where they have very good facilities so we are uh, like get, getting to know like whatever the up to date market is like what are trends they are following so what are the other inventions which we can make so that's a where a good uh, stand out where giving us a lot of data what we can make on then this uh, they have very pretty good networking structure where like this program is pretty good uh, followed has like a stanford bio design where they have pretty good uh, mentors for coming up from abroad also for getting the unmet needs and all and few of our mentors are from different hospitals and all throughout the india where coming up in each phases and trying to unmet the needs whatever required So what I would be expecting from this, like if I can get lot of details about the uh, unmet areas from this conference, where like, where what are the regulations or what are the marketing needs? If a person can meet a networking site, that would be really helpful for me, where I can get the contacts of that. Thank you. Hi, myself, Dr. Sindhu Kumar. I am from Jaipur, Rajasthan. I did my MBBS from Pune to Rajasthan. After that, uh, after that, I did uh, my master's in medical science and technology from IIT Kharagpur. And after that, uh, I decided uh, to do something my own. That's why I am here. 
Uh, currently, I'm uh, looking for a positive 15 point of care devices. Basically, I want to provide uh, technology enabled equitable health care to Indian population, uh, especially in rural area. I'm working on it. And uh, here, uh, the people who are from different, different backgrounds, uh, diversity is very good. We have a marketing person, software engineers, and uh, people are very supporting here. And uh, best, uh, being a doctor, uh, I don't know about uh, the startup and these things very much. And, uh, I am learning many things here from different, different people, from different, different backgrounds. Thank you. Hi, I am Iftak. Uh, I am from a small village from Assam, northeast, and uh, I have seen many problems in my place itself. This why, like, uh, I've done my this uh, masters in physics in Tashpur University, and after that, uh, I have uh, joined as a PhD scholar in the same university itself. Uh, in a PhD, I have worked on this developing this uh, low cost diagnostic devices, and uh, the devices which can uh, work as that of the lab instrument. So I work with uh, this uh, UNICEF. And I worked with National Innovation Foundation and uh, developing technologies for these uh, farmers and they are already working with that. And uh, uh, previously I worked as an innovation scholar uh, in the Rasal Bhavan itself. So now here uh, in the Rasal Bhavan I have known about this uh, CFHE, then I have applied. Now I am here in working as a fellow. Now in my journey what we have seen is that uh, we have gone through different hospitals and uh, we have seen many technological advancements like uh, from device prospects so from the skills that i have uh, in my phd that can be brought like many technologies or these innovations from the healthcare field itself and uh, we have a uh, good very we have very good team support like uh, we have from doctors to my, uh, this uh, biotech guy to this mba so like uh, if i can contribute something technologically or give give the scientific ideas to our innovation and through that way, like uh, we want to work on different prospect of technologies uh, from point of care. Basically, I am trying to do something for my the problems that I've seen in my own place, like uh, from diarrhea to this pneumonia and many things. So if I get to know something regarding development of something which can help my people itself, then that is my idea to so being in this uh, CFHC. And CFHC is giving good support from this uh, the we have any good support from doctors to this uh, engineers and marketing guy and uh, we have a uh, good MOU with different different hospitals. So now here we have CFH. So this is the journey that we have till now. Uh, hello, I am Sagar from Nagpur. So I did my bachelor's in computer science and engineering. And after that I worked for two years with the IBM partnered company. And later on I started uh, a company. Uh, which is into digital marketing and software solutions so according to me like uh, computer science guys and software guys are more biased towards softwares so they don't they know like what to do with software and how it will work but they actually don't know how the ground reality will work when it comes to healthcare so that's why i'm here to know more about uh, how healthcare domain works when it comes to hospital and many more things so from healthcare summit uh, i'm looking forward to meet different people from multiple backgrounds like startup founders to VCs to investors so I can get uh, good knowledge about them on the product so if I am going to design a product I should fail fast and so that I will get to know more how should it get to be done right correctly if not I will choose a different way to do that yeah so look forward looking forward to see you guys there thank you